Well, so I'm looking at one thing that I've seen around, and it looks like uh, some political activity going on. Um, I'm just gonna. I'm. I'm, I'm not gonna make it a extremely sophisticated um, video for this one video message because I just it's not my favorite subject. But um, you know. Um, So, I think that what we're trying to say about the homeless people in, in this case is like, um, no, that's not what happened, right? That's not what happened. That's not what happened. That's not what happened. And there's only so many different explanations for that, you know? Um, I think that um, you could be talking about how you're looking at the future. And this is what people are going to remember. The homeless people were being nice to everybody. Everybody was leaving them on the sidewalk. And, uh, and, um, and we were just harassing them all over the place and like, no, that's not what happened. Right? Okay. So what did that person just say? They said, no, that's not what happens to the homeless person, though. No, that's not what happens to the homeless person. And that's going to change everything. And um, and the other thing is that when you get into the just, just this philosophy in general, that it's something that I was talking about once before, is that there is a legitimate reason why people go to a mental institution. And that's one of them. Um, homeless people being homeless, homeless people not having money. No, this is not a legitimate reason for a homeless person to go to a mental institution. Um, no, that's not what happened. No, that's not what happens to the homeless person. Yes, that is a legitimate reason why people might end up in a mental institution. So whatever those realities are communicating for you could be something to think about.